man, I cannot keep up with this gale force shitstorm. I mean, like, when is this terrifying conspiracy with Putin going to explode? It's like a canker sore, and I, I can't leave it alone. Well, sounds like somebody needs a little bit of self-care. I, too, had nagging feelings of personal responsibility with the looming political crisis. But now I take these. I mean, I've been wanting to go to the protest marches, but it's been raining. I've stopped calling my Congress people. I feel so guilty. Oh, I get it. I used to feel the exact same way. But now I take complacency. Complacency's padded in formula alleviates enough buildup of liberal guilt so that even one Facebook post can convince you that you're doing your part. You have the freedom to go about your day knowing you and yours will be just fine. Believe it or not, I used to worry the police would come and take people away to camps in the middle of the night. Now, I just go camping. <laughs> come on, kids! But Daddy, where are they taking the lead? That's not our problem, honey. Okay. Ask your doctor if complacency is covered in your Trump care plan. Known effects of complacency include an inability to perceive certain things and events, such as a $20 billion border wall, deconstructing the Departments of Education, HUD, and EPA, eliminating health coverage for 18 million Americans, personal enrichment of the President's family through development deals, inflated real estate fees, and other emoluments, collusion with a hostile foreign nation to undermine the democratic process, unhinged threatening rhetoric intended to suppress freedom of the press, intimidate political opponents, and grant winking support to proto-fascism, and much, much more. 